Yeah, now these are jeans with a G, not denim jeans with a J. <laughs> yeah, indeed. The people of Merseyside were challenged to research their history to find the oldest family in the city so they could help celebrate Liverpool's 800th birthday. Well, not only have that very special family been found in Rainhill, they've also helped to solve an historical mystery. Sarah Elliott explains. Hi. Meet the oldest family in Liverpool. We're not being cheeky. Tony and Pauline George have ancestry going back centuries and they can prove it too. People are amazed, aren't they? Um, to think that we've got back that far. People expect you just to say the 1800s or 1700s, but... 1500s, that's another story. Their deep roots recently won them a competition to find Liverpool's oldest family to celebrate the city's 800th birthday. When they started digging, well, they just dug deeper and found Thomas Woodley, born in the 1500s, and Tony's great, 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 well, a very, very great grandfather. Great, 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 great. And you can carry on further if you want and cause a laugh. But it is hard to explain to people, isn't it? That's me in 1940, yeah. in the pram. Yeah. This is Joseph Lee, the brother of my grandmother. And this is our grandson, Harry, who's 15 months old, and he's the last of the line to be born. With 14 generations, it's not surprising Tony has links to practically the whole of Liverpool, the most significant in the 1700s, a connection to Speak Hall. Ancestors had rented it, but they allowed it to fall into disrepair. Apparently, the Graces kept cows in the library and allowed the ivy to grow in through the windows. The second cousin, Primrose, uh, she has, um, won't hear of that, of the vandalism. No, And no. she's put her side of the story to it. Mm. Even Tony's mother, she would never have dreamt that her family ever had anything to do with Speak Hall. Next week, Tony's family will take part in birthday celebrations representing the people of Liverpool. They'll lead a procession through the city, meet Ken Dodd and watch fireworks from the River Mersey. So we're very stunned and surprised mm -hmm. about it all. Mm -hmm. We're glad that we're Scousers and uh, that our family, um, Tony's family, has uh, stretched back so far and his mother would be so proud. Proud of all the generations, no doubt, even those troublesome tenants. Sarah Elliott, Granada Reports, Liverpool. What a great story. Yeah. Shame they didn't get Speak Hall as the prize, really. Anyway, still to come. More than 20 services, but stressed no decision to cut services had been taken yet. A couple from Rainhill have won a competition to find the oldest family in Liverpool. Tony and Pauline George have roots going back to 1543. At one time in the 18th century, the family were tenants at the historic Speak Hall. The Georges, who will now lead a civic procession later this month, said they were shocked at their success. Really proud and made up, really. Um, mm. Stunned. Mm. Uh, we didn't think we didn't that expect, when we got... You know, didn't expect uh, that we would be... Thought we had a chance of being it, you know, but we didn't realise that uh, we would be the oldest family in Liverpool.